cutting time. So uh, we're about to make our first cut of our aluminum, aluminum that will actually be on our airplane. And so, uh, Caleb, the honors are yours. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. hey now. That's, uh, that's crazy fast. So the two outside ones hold still. And then the middle one goes back and forth and acts like a scissors. Do it again. That's crazy fast. That's and that is going to save us a ton of shear time. Yes. The edges that it is leaving behind, it just removes this one little strip. And the edges that it leaves behind are very nice and clean. And we're also not having any problems with the the plastic film, so that's real good. Our first cut. Yes. I know it's just a little square, but this is really exciting to me. That's gonna be on our airplane. Heck yeah. Nice. A lot more to go. Okay, so we made our first cut with the shears. We just made one simple straight long one. We figured straight would be the best place to start. Uh, we were a little scared with the first couple inches. We thought that we wouldn't be able to pivot it and move it around, but we figured it out, you can. And uh, yeah, it makes a nice clean cut. It just leaves you this uh, pretty little tinsel uh, that it cuts out of the middle and we also didn't have any problem with our uh, film that we left on. We had a little bit of build up on the tips of the shears but it's probably just because of heat and we can just clean it right off and keep moving. So we made our first cut. Yay! And I'm putting that on my Christmas tree this year. We're gonna have a bear hawk Christmas tree. Yes. There will be plenty more of these. <laughs> This is fun. Those will be our two full size ribs. There's only two in the whole bird, and there they are. Pretty flimsy. <laughs> so, we finished cutting our first whole sheet of aluminum 2024 T3, uh, 25 thousandths. And we got our nose ribs, some of the nose ribs out of it, some ailerons out of it. And uh, next we're going to start tracing onto our single sheet of 4x12, which this is a long sheet. So we had to get creative with our benches to uh, stretch it out. But uh, we're going to start tracing on it. And uh, this 4x12 this sheet's a lot bigger than I expected. But, uh, but we're making airplane parts.